Hello everybody, this is Chris and welcome back to this tutorial video on creating a login registration form. In this tutorial we're going to go ahead in this video we're going to go ahead and create the registration page. So I have this pretty much set up here and I'm just going to copy and paste from our login page because I'm not going to go through all that again. So I'm just going to copy, I'm going to register here and hit paste. So instead of saying please login, I'm just going to say please register. I'm not above copying and pasting my own stuff. So we're just going to add a text field. So form text. This is going to be username. And nothing. And of course a placeholder, but we need an array for that. Placeholder. And it's gonna be username. And just let me scan through this and make sure all this other stuff is right. So the email array placeholder, email. Form password, password, form submit. We could add a password confirm, but I'm not going to log in change out the register register and then instead of register we're gonna say back to the home say cancel and then we we'll change the button to button danger which will give us a red button and now we'll go into the routes and we'll say route register. Get register. Let's say function. Turn view make home dot register. that in there, go down in that line and then let's try it out. So let's say register and there we go. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Go back to login, register, cancel, login. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and throw these into a class. We'll actually throw these into a controller rather. So we'll come up here to, we're going to leave them in the home controller since it's already registered here. Let's find, where's my controller set? There they are. The home controller here. So I'm going to use git post, the RESTful actions from level 3.2, but they're slightly different because all functions now are camel case. And that's the only difference. So public function git index. So get index. To do that I'm just going to return view make and then it's going to be home.index. That's good enough. Next we'll go ahead and return our login page. So public function get login. I've seen people complain about oh there's such ugly controllers and stuff like that but you know whatever uh, like I said I've seen source code for many applications in Laravel and they all use the same uh, thing they always use this git login git index and stuff like that so if you think they're ugly okay so what whatever I really don't care they work git register And we'll return view make, and this one's home that log home dot register. So now we go out to the routes here, and we change. We can get rid of all this, and just say route get. It's going to be default. Next, it's going to be home controller. 
at get index. That I'm gonna copy that. So paste, paste, login, register, login. register and that's making sure it all works so it looks like it works here login register that works cancel go back out here so there we go it's all linked into our controllers so next video we're gonna go ahead and do our registration and I'll see you in that video